I've, I've grown up here, in case you didn't know, I grew up in London, and I've seen London change, man, through gentrification and stuff like that. Like, I remember going, the only time that I would go to Hackney would be to get shot. That would be the only reason. <laughs> now, that's where I go to get my vegan chicken. <laughs> what change? I mean, I'm not even vegan, I just do it to fit in, man. <laughs> Are there any vegans in, by the way? You probably would have said straight off the bat, but if they're... <laughs> I was vegan for six months. I think it's a good thing to do. It's a good way to try and save the planet. I was vegan for six months, and I stopped because I had an argument with a more militant vegan than me over honey, right? <laughs> the whole thing was just... I like honey in my tea, man. I'm a fucking bougie guy like that. <laughs> and... <laughs> what the fuck am I talking about? I don't... <laughs> Anyway, I put some honey in my tea and I look up and this vegan brother, he's wearing the I'm about to educate you face. You ever seen this shit? You know you fucked up. I look up, this guy goes. <laughs> and I went, what's wrong? He goes, oh, you're putting honey in your tea. <laughs> you know that you're funding slavery. <laughs> and I said, what the fuck are you talking about, mate? And he goes, bees are enslaved and they're forced to make honey. <laughs> and I went, don't bees make honey anyway? <laughs> he goes, yes, but we force them to make more. And I'm like, I don't think you know how slavery works, mate. <laughs> he goes, I do, that's slavery. I went, no, you don't know how slavery works, all right? If they're making honey anyway, that's not enslavement. Like, if I get a bunch of black people, put them in a field, they're not picking cotton because that's what they do, all right? <laughs> You've got no, like, don't be tense, white people. That was a fucking funny joke. <laughs> Come on, ethnic that shit up. Where's the laugh now? I need that shit. <laughs> And this guy went, every living thing should be free from bondage. And that's when I just lost my head. <laughs> and I thought, I'm going to ruin this guy's life now, man. And I start saying things that I don't even believe, right? I go, mm, how bad is slavery really? <laughs> really, how bad is it? And this guy goes, slavery is the worst thing ever invented. And I went, oh, you say that, but from the outside, it don't look too bad. Think about it, you're outside with your family, getting exercise, singing songs and shit. It looks all right, man. And this guy goes again, he goes, every living thing should be free from bondage. Freedom is a right. And I went, ah, I, don't, I don't think freedom should be a right anymore. <laughs> and he went, what do you mean? I went, I think a lot of people are wasting freedom, man. I've got to be honest, freedom is going to waste. For example, a couple of weeks ago, I saw a guy put ketchup on a banana. No more freedom for that guy. <laughs> That's what I think, man. 